Hey, everybody, how's it going? Uh, this lights right my uh, glasses, so I'm gonna take my glasses off. Uh, so it's not blaring your face. Anyways, who cares? We'll give them my glasses. That's not why you watch this video, know about my glasses and light in there. Listen, you're on Facebook, you're watching this on Facebook, you've seen, you know, to all, <laughs> you've seen tons of like, hey, VA, you know, get on here. Well, like, we close deals for you and we'll show you how to, you know, make all this money and, you know, and real, wholesale real estate and everything, right? You've seen those. I've seen them. I see them all the time. In fact, people on this uh, group are like, hey, you need help with VA, blah, blah. The, you know, listen, I have nothing against somebody in, you know, third world country, Philippines, India, wherever, you know, hustling to make some cash. You know, VAs are good. I've had VAs. I like VAs. They're good guys, good gals. But listen to me, okay? I, I'm so serious about this. It, to the to the degree, I would exhort you to hit pause in this video, grab a pen, and take a few notes. Because I want to tell you some, I'm gonna tell you some stuff that's gonna not only save you a whole bunch of money, money, time, mojo, and Austin Powers, mojo. I mean, I mean time on mojo. You need these three, okay? Money, time, mojo. Mojo's important, okay? Look, I'm not Tony Robbins. I, I'm not going to make a bunch of videos about, you know, Mojo. But you got to have Mojo for this, okay? <clears throat> so, taking notes, here's, here's, here's the point, okay? I, I'm, I know nothing against VA folks, but the most, the most important aspect to this entire business in real estate, wholesaling real estate, okay? Any kind of real estate. You know, particularly wholesaling, because you're connecting the dots, right? There's a cash buyer, there's a seller, there's there's some strategies here, blah, blah, and you gotta like you gotta control everything. You gotta put it here, and you have complete control so you make money, right? Look, if you <laughs> if it's not you doing it, you're not in control. You will lose the deal. Did I say that? You know, clearly enough. Like, I care about you guys. So that's why I have this Facebook page. That's why I have these the YouTube videos. This is why I do what I do, because I, I, I've been there. I'm on a mission. I, I don't want to see you guys make the same mistakes that I have. Trust me, I've made a few mistakes over the years, and it's not fun. You don't need the shenanigans, okay? When you get a, the purpose of a VA is not to do the most important job. Listen to me. Just, 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 just think about this for a second, okay? You know, your life sucks. You work at nine to five. Maybe you're working, you know, six to six to ten. You know, I mean, we're going to go crazy hours. You know, life's the horrible. You know, two jobs, maybe. Maybe you're a single mom and you're struggling and whatever. You Maybe you're a single dad and the wife left you. I'm a friend Bland. I mean, it's bad stuff, okay? I mean, okay, you're in bad. So, so, so you want a better life for yourself. And God bless you. And that's why you're here, right? Okay. Don't be deceived, okay? If you get some sort of like, hey, buy this mentorship or hey, this, this VA service, blah, blah, blah. And all you got to do is sit back and, you know, I was going to say something that's inappropriate, but I won't. You do something, you know, you just sit back and, and, and uh, have a cup of tea. That's not inappropriate. Have a cup of tea. And the VAs and deals work for you. The VA will negotiate all those deals, and all you gotta do is bring the buyer, and they connect, and keep drinking, <laughs> drinking that appropriate, not offensive tea, and you'll make you know fifty grand a month. Does that sound rational to you? Does that sound too good to be true? Too good to be true? You just sit around drinking your tea, and this VA in Pakistan's gonna connect with the buyer and, and negotiate the deal and. And you, oh, by the way, you're paying that, you know, Pakistani, uh, another one Pakistani, but it has been Pakistan, preach the gospel and help translate the Bible. So I'm not like anti Pakistan, pro Pakistan. Okay. But anyway, point is, this Pakistani is negotiating a deal and all this kind of thing. Uh, does that, you know, for five bucks an hour, does that sound too good to be true? Yeah, it's too good to be true. Okay. Look, listen to me. The point of this video is to say that the, the most important aspect of this entire business is you. You. 
Not me, not Santa Claus, not Tooth Fairy, not my dad translating the Bible in Pakistan. No, you, okay? <laughs> you have to be, you, you're connecting all the dots. If you outsource you, like the most important you aspect, yeah, you're going to struggle. And struggle is, is, is a nice word to say. You're gonna you're you're gonna lose and you're gonna be you're gonna lose your mojo. Like awesome powers, right? All right, those dates me. Or anyway, who cares? But date me. But you have my point, right? You can't you this is not what you do. You negotiate with the seller. This is what you do. If you want to be successful, okay? And v, there's nothing wrong with the VA, but the VA has no business, zero business negotiating. You know, a deal where you could potentially be making fifty, sixty, seventy thousand dollars, and they're making five bucks an hour. You know, I shit's fifty, you know, like or three bucks an hour, whatever that you're paying your VA. That's <laughs> I'm laughing because it, just think about the absurdity of it. You pay somebody three bucks an hour, five bucks an hour, and they're going to start negotiating, you know, making you sixty, seventy thousand bucks. Does that sound reasonable to you? Hopefully not, because it's not reasonable. In fact, it's absurd. That's right. I said it out loud. It's absurd, okay? So let me tell you, this is the place for your VA. VAs are important. VAs are good for data entry. VAs are good for spreadsheets, setting appointments, this and this and that. <clears throat> but negotiating the deal, that is on you, my friend, okay? That is on you, and you have to master that. Okay, you cannot outsource, you cannot outsource a VA, even a salesperson, you, unless you have a really, really super good sales guy like me or somebody else that knows how to sell. Okay, you cannot outsource your salesperson because that is how the money is made. This is how it's all, all structured. Okay, do you understand what I'm saying? Why, why am I saying this? You know, what, why? Why this video? Why are you upset? Why are you, you know, blah, 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 fussing around? Listen, I hear so many times folks, they start out and they, you know, I, I guess they get on, on, on Facebook and they, you know, they say, yeah, all oh, what you need is a VA to make the calls and these cold, that was on a cold call. What you got to do is do a cold call. Well, okay, fine. Cold calling, cold calling is hard, okay? And it, 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 you know, cold calling is one thing. You want to turn them from cold to warm, like I think. Well, when you, we, if, if all you have is a VA to try and negotiate deals from a cold call to a sale, you're asking for trouble. You're because they, that's not their, they can't do that. They're not you. And what do I mean? Well, what do you mean? They're not me. How dare you? You don't know what I'm talking. Look, behave yourself. Okay. Listen to me. I want to help you. That's what I'm making this video. And, and it is sad because I see so. What I'm, what I'm saying to you right now isn't like I just ran, I woke up one morning and thought, you know, I'm going to talk about VA today. No, I get the feedback every single freaking day, okay? And and and, and this, is, this is the reality, okay? It's your job, you as, as a professional real estate investor, to listen to the seller, okay? Listen to them. And then in wisdom, they figure out the problem. They, they have a problem. They have a problem. And, they, and honestly, if I'm out, they may not have a problem. They may be like, hey, I don't want to sell. And I would say, hey, if you don't want to sell, don't sell. I'd keep it for the next 10 years. And they may and they, and they may say to me, you know, yeah, I, I, man, I think you get a good point. I think I'll just keep on for 10 years. You think that guy's motivated to sell? Do you think he's worth your time on the phone call? Pro probably not. You might want to just hang up the freaking phone and call somebody else who does have a problem. Okay, does that make sense? So you sort out what the seller's problem is, and they legitimately have a problem that you should do, not your VA, because you're intelligent. I'm not saying VAs are intelligent, not non-intelligent. <coughs> I'm simply saying, <coughs> other than coughing, that you know you 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 need to lose your you know business acumen. Listen to what what are they saying? Are you, what situation they have a problem, and then proffer a solution. Proffer a solution because you have solutions that's what this facebook but, but you know uh, groups about so youtube videos about about solutions to sellers problems 
a VA cannot do that. <clears throat> a VA, can, I mean, they have, you know, they can do the certain skills, but I mean, think about it. They made five bucks an hour. Five bucks an hour. You know what my first job was? I worked at Bonanza Restaurant back in, oh man, 1980, was eight or six or something? And that would make it th <laughs> three thirty-five an hour. Okay. You think back when I was working in Bonanza Restaurant making three thirty-five an hour? You think I could have closed the deal so you would have made twenty, you know, forty grand? You want me to tell you the answer to that one? If you want me to tell you the answer to that one, uh, you know, you might want to get off the video. Look, listen to me. No, I could not have. I, that's not my job. I'm making three. I was making. <laughs> I was making three thirty-five an hour because that's all I was worth. Okay. So the most important job in this business is for you to close. You got to do it and you can do it because you can solve sellers' problems. Okay. That's the thing. Nothing wrong with the VA, but if you have a VA, have them do other stuff, you know, organize data, appointment setting. I mean, there's, there's tons of stuff the VA can do, but closing deals, that's your job. And if you, if you have a VA and that's their job to close deals, why does the VA need you? If they're getting the lead, and the VA has all the leads, and the VA is closing the deals. Why? Why? Why are you? What's your job? Right? No, literally, you close deals. You know the solution to sellers' problems because you are a real estate professional. I'm not to me trying to be dramatic here, but I really want to emphasize how important. It is for you, you, to, 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 as a professional, to listen to a seller. Mr. Seller, what's your problem? Why are we talking right now? What's your situation? Why would you want to sell your house for? People don't sell their houses every day. How can I help you, right? And then they, my wife died. Kids and grandkids are in Miami. Okay, so now if I can help you get to Miami, George, can we do some business today, right? Does that, does that make sense? So now we have a solution to George's problem, right? It's not it's not the VA in the Philippines or Pakistan. No, it's you doing it. That's my point, okay? I hope this helps. I hope you're encouraged. Don't be discouraged. I just I hate to see folks spend a whole bunch, you know, six months, a year of no, of no success. They have a VA trying to do all this stuff. And this happens often. It's, it's heartbreaking because, I mean, these you know, folks like you, they really believe in, in making money in real estate and they do it wrong because for whatever reason, they think having a VA negotiating because I don't know, they're reading the sales copy in the Facebook groups or something and they do it. That's not, you don't need that. Okay. You can do this. If you need any help, if you want to role play, if you want mentorship, okay, talk to me and, and you know, just go down here, send me a message, call me, so an appointment, I mean, a video course, the whole thing, but you can do this. Listen, the one who's going to make you successful in this business is you. You're the person connecting the dots, okay? Don't be discouraged. Don't give up. And maybe that's been you. Maybe, you, maybe you've been the person who's been almost about an MBA and everything. Stop it right now and make a change. You be the one to solve some of those problems, Okay. So if you need help, again, call me up, mentorship, whatever, talk, talking's free, and uh, we'll help you out, okay? Godspeed. Be, be blessed.